Yo, what is going on guys? It's your boy Huggy here bringing you guys a brand new video. Now in today's video I got something a little bit different for you guys. It's not going to be a crunker video unfortunately But today I will be showing you guys my 2022 gaming slash streaming setup So if you guys do enjoy the video make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you guys are new We're trying to get back to 15k so any love and support is genuinely appreciated now Let's get into the setup all right, guys, since I don't actually have like a normal, like actual camera that people use to record these types of videos, I actually am just going to be recording this on my iPhone. So hopefully the audio sounds good. Hopefully the video quality is good as well. Also, if I look extremely exhausted, bloodshot eyes, whatever it may be, I am extremely tired. I've been trying to get this room all set up over the, the course of the last like eight hours or so. So if I look exhausted or sound exhausted, I just know I am exhausted. Just trying to get this video out for you guys. All right, guys, this is what you see as you walk into my room i actually do have the smallest room in the house unfortunately so like as you guys can see i don't really got much room for activities going on here but you know we got to make do with what we got so when you walk in this is what you're greeted with we got the the rgb floodlights going on down here for the the lighting on the background of the wall and stuff like that and we got a bunch of acoustic panels on the wall to actually try to just like make the sound not as echoey stuff like that it, I, it probably doesn't work that well but you know we gotta we gotta do what we got you know what i mean so and then we head over here we got a little bookshelf that i have a bunch of stuff on display uh we got the we got the pop figures on two different shelves i actually couldn't fit those ones down there so they're up there for now it's whatever uh, we got the G Fuel Tower right here. G Fuel, please sponsor me. I would love to work with you guys. And then we got a bunch of other cool stuff here. We got my Nintendo 3DS here, my Poke Walker for Heart Gold and Soul Silver, some AirPods, things like that. And then if we head down here, we got a bunch of Xbox 360 games, uh, a DS Lite, DSi, and then a bunch of Pokemon boxes, Pokemon games. I'm a huge Pokemon fan. I love Pokemon. All right. Can you blame me? And then down here, we got some more products. We got the Glorious Model O box, Wave XLR, which is amazing, by the way. If you guys are content creators, I highly recommend getting one of these. It's so good. The School Candy headphone box. These headphones are actually fire, too. And behind this, we actually have the Corsair K65 mini keyboard box, which is the keyboard I'm actually using right now. So that's what we got going on here. Not too much going on, just a bunch of display stuff. Uh, and then we got my bed and then another rgb light because you know i gotta get the lighting in here for you guys and then here is the actual setup let me get a a quick overview for you guys real quick all right so here's where everything actually goes down real quick before we do get into the the pc the the powerhouse of the whole operation here we're gonna we're gonna go through this uh, right here, we got the, the Respawn RSP110 gaming chair, I believe is what it's called. It, it's all beat up because it's an old chair. All the leather is like starting to crack and stuff like that. But still an extremely comfortable chair. Very good. And then over here, we got the Astro A40 headset. This has my, been my daily driver headset for, I don't know, probably like two, three years now. Uh, and that's hooked up to the, the Astro Mix Amp, which is right next to the Wave XLR, which I was just hyping up over by the bookshelf for you guys. Oh, I just punched my mic. Didn't mean to do that. And then right here, we got the Nintendo Switch with some Pokemon games because, like I said, I'm a Pokemon fiend, bro. I'm a Pokemon fiend. And then right here, we have the Audio-Technica AT2035 XLR microphone. This thing's an absolute beast, and it's a great value, too. I'm pretty sure this mic's only, like, $140 or something like that. Not bad at all. And then right here, we got the Corsair K65 keyboard that I was just showing the box about. And then we also have the Glorious Model O mouse, which has been an amazing mouse. I highly recommend getting one if you guys don't have one. Let's take a quick seat here just so you guys can see what I'm working with. And then right here is actually the Wavelink software, which is what the Wave XLR uses. That's what mixes all my audio stuff like that, outputs it to a stream output very very good software although i've been having a little bit of difficulties with it a bunch of obscure things that honestly should have been fixed that haven't been fixed but you know the software is getting there the wave xlr i'm pretty sure only came out like literally a few months ago so can't fault them too much you know what i mean and we got the a g fuel shaker because i was drinking g fuel before i actually started this video as i told you guys i have been up for an extremely long time trying to get this video out for you guys and then right here we have the elgato stream deck if you guys couldn't tell i got a lot of elgato products elgato literally just makes everything that you need to be a content creator so and then up here we have the logitech c920 webcam this is a pretty standard webcam that most content creators streamers use uh and then we got the the ring light for the the beautiful lighting to make myself look kind of pretty but not pretty I don't, I don't know dude all right 
This is the powerhouse of the whole operation right here. This is my PC. Inside, we actually have a Ryzen 7 3700X, 16 gigs of 3200 megahertz, DDR4 Corsair Vengeance RAM. The graphics card is actually an RTX 2060 KO from EVGA. This graphics card has done an extremely amazing job of being my daily driver for the past two years. Um, and I don't remember what the power supply is. I think it's an EVGA like 650 watt or something like that. Uh, we got the NZXT Kraken X62 cooler, I believe is what it's called. I got this thing a long time ago. I actually need to replace it because it's probably going out by now. It's like two or three years old at this point, but it gets the job done for now. And then the motherboard is actually the MSI B450 Tomahawk Max, which pairs amazingly with the Ryzen 7 3700X. Oh, and I can't forget about the, the beautiful case here, the NZXT H510 elite i'm pretty sure it's got a tempered glass side panel it looks just overall amazing sorry if it's a little bit dusty in there i tried to clean it recently but i didn't have any canned air so i've been waiting on getting some canned air to to make it more purdy but yeah that is what we're rocking with on the pc side bro by the way i got this new desk for christmas and it's absolutely amazing it literally like is long enough for all of my needs and then it also over here has a like a little like power strip built into it which is super nice also the dual monitor mount you know the vibes i also can't forget that i actually forgot to mention the monitor setup that we got going on it's 165 hertz one millisecond response time gaming monitor it's a super nice monitor i think i picked it up for probably like 149 dollars or something like that been an extremely good monitor i love it very dearly and then for the second monitor over here we have some samsung monitor that i picked up probably like four years ago now this monitor is extremely old I, I think I picked it up for around the same price as this monitor, but uh, it's nowhere near the specs. This thing is probably like 60 hertz, like probably three millisecond response time. This thing is not made for gaming, but I did actually game off of it for the majority of my streaming and content career. But yeah, that is my gaming setup. Hopefully you guys get a little bit of insight to what I'm working with here. That was my 2022 gaming setup video. If you guys did enjoy, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you guys are new to the channel. I'm extremely excited to be back and making content again. So all the support recently has genuinely been appreciated. Thank you guys so much. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Later.